About 20 million women and 10 million men in America have an eating disorder at some point in their lives. Today, advocates for those dealing with the disease gathered at the State House. Donnie Mercer Plank was one of those helping bring awareness to this disease. And Donnie, you brought up a pretty stark statistic here when you said Isn't it's the it most terrible? fatal mental illness. Yes, and, and you both know, Judy and Greg, mm -hmm. that my husband and I have chosen to be very open about this, how it has affected one of our children. So we were there for advocacy day at the state house to bring attention to the fact that nearly one person dies every hour of every day from the complications of an eating disorder. The majority of eating disorders begin between the ages of 18 and 25, which is why early education is important because it affects so many families. Right here in our state, the South Carolina Eating Disorders Association wants legislators to know the majority of those with an eating disorder will not get treatment because of the stigma of the mental illness. Which we're just hoping to bring awareness to eating disorders in general. About 50% of people know someone that's been impacted by an eating disorder, either personally or they know someone else. But only one in 10 people actually receive treatment. This can be due to just not being diagnosed or lack of insurance coverage or just not being able to afford care. In the House chamber today, Representative Beth Bernstein recognized the efforts of the South Carolina Eating Disorders Association, asking fellow lawmakers to open their eyes to the dangers of eating disorders and reminding the House chamber that though eating disorders have the highest mortality rate of any mental illness, those with the disease can still live productive lives if they receive treatment. And then later in the Senate chamber, Senator uh, Katrina Sheely mm -hmm. had recognized the organization as well. Yeah, getting treatment so important. Important, you Getting know, the word out about eliminating it. Eliminating the stigma. Yeah, thanks. All right, thank you, Dondi.